The weekend is here, and what better time to play some of the dumbest mods in all of Hearts of Iron 4, starting off today with uh, the, the coronavirus mod. I mean, of, of course somebody had to make this, like, why am I even surprised? <laughs> Pretty ordinary looking menu here, we had to go back a few versions because this mod has not been updated for quite a few years, surprise surprise. Let's go single player, new game, and uh, <laughs> we have France, we have the United States, we have the United Kingdom, we have the German Reich, and um... Yeah, that we, we have coronavirus. <laughs> Honestly, wouldn't this mod make a lot more sense if it was set in Millennium Dawn? But but no, we're just in 1936 and coronavirus is just here. Um, By 2021, COVID-19 was nearly wiped out and an advancing healthcare system contributed to this blah, 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 blah. Can we make coronavirus work in 1936? Uh, <laughs> well, let's see. I'll give you three guesses to where my capital is. Uh, of course, it is Wuhan. <laughs> We start with our uh, 120 divisions. Um, yeah, that 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 is a that is a lot of people infected. That is. I don't really know what's gonna happen. Like, if we're gonna declare war on China, maybe we should justify a war goal. Sure, let's justify a war goal just in case we don't get any war goals. I mean, <laughs> I mean, we basically have the biggest army on the planet, except for the Soviets. But their army is like 50k guns short, and my army is fully equipped because uh, COVID logic. Am I right? Let's draw a front line and. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Let's prepare to destroy China. Oh my god. I bet Chiang Kai-shek's gonna be like, what the f- Uh, I also noticed that we don't have a focus tree, so... Yeah, there's that, so nothing to do in here. Let's just unpause and see what happens. I honestly don't know. Oh, okay, we just declared war on China. We didn't even need to justify a war goal, and, uh, yeah. I think- I think we could just battle plan this, because COVID is so freaking strong right now. I love how, ironically, this is a, uh, pretty accurate historical reenactment of COVID. Like, um... Yeah, it, it, it happened pretty damn fast, didn't it? I mean, we already have 1.3 million people infected. We just declared war on Guangxi. I think it might be that any country we share a border with, we just automatically declare war on them, which honestly makes sense. I mean, we are a literal virus, so, uh... <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Let's go battle planning. Honestly, this is so satisfying. After all of my microing runs and all of my other games as, like, the worst countries in Hoi 4, gotta say, this is, like, some sort of therapy for me, okay? We're just battle planning our way to victory. We just got a border with Hong Kong, so we are at war with the UK. Um, very fun. I mean, <laughs> even though we are a strong-ass virus, I am in no way looking forward to a war with the Allies. I mean, we can just battle plan, so uh, that's very cool. We captured a goal, which means that we get extra divisions, which is very cool. I'm guessing that we just keep getting extra divisions and I don't have to bother training anything. I mean, uh, I don't think I can train anything. I can train infected animals. <laughs> I can, like, train a bunch of bats to fly at people. Oh my god. <laughs> I must say, COVID, uh, yeah, it's it's spreading pretty damn quickly. At this rate, yeah, everyone's gonna be doing online school again, aren't they? <laughs> well, uh, that, that, that is, uh, that is Taiwan fully, uh, fully infected. But this is version 1.10, so, uh, stuff is, uh, stuff is gonna look pretty weird, but, um, yeah, the mod makers seem to have given up developing the mod after COVID stopped being a thing, which honestly makes sense, and, um, Mussolini wants to join my faction because, of course, coronavirus is, uh, yeah, it's the Schmittler ideology. Um, well, I, I, welcome to the faction, Italy. I, I have no idea what this is gonna do. Like, are we gonna just infect Italy? That would be very cool, actually. Oh, and our convoys are getting raided by America. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't have, I don't have a navy. That's, uh, that's the problem. And we just straight up annexed Italy. What the hell? <laughs> well, China just capitulated. I guess that's, that's China fully infected, but, um, Japanese reinforcements have arrived. Why is Japan helping China? This is the, this is the most most cursed timeline in the world. When you can get Japan and China to be friends in 1936, uh, yeah, you know you, uh, you've done some pretty bad stuff. Honestly, the, uh, the thing I hate the most about countries capitulating is the freaking front lines. Like, oh my god, even though I'm an overpowered virus, I still gotta draw front lines like a peasant. Like, oh my god, thank you, Paradox. <laughs> well, I guess we're at war with Yunnan now, and also we're already at war with the Raj, and also, oh my god, we're at war with Tibet. I hate fighting in Tibet. There's no supply there! It's not gonna be long before we get to the Mongolian border, and that's when we get to go to war with the Soviets, which means, uh, pushing through Siberia, which will be very, very 
fun, but I don't think we're gonna have too much trouble because, again, OP coronavirus buff. You know what? One thing's never gonna change. Uh, Japan is, is gonna naval invade you. I don't care if you're nationalist China or communist China or if you are literally a freaking virus. Uh, yeah, the, the allies will, will never stop their naval invasions. <laughs> I honestly don't know why there is a French division um, from Madagascar encircled in the uh, mountains of Shanxi. Um, <laughs> uh, well done, France. I mean, uh, they are failing to break our line of coronavirus in Italy, so this is going very well. Well, it looks like Japan has reinvaded Taiwan. I mean, I'm not really sure how this works, because uh, when I take territory, I infect it, so when they take it back, what are they doing? Are they just, like, spraying bleach everywhere? <laughs> are they just making everyone drink bleach? Like, I, I honestly don't understand. And is there a way we can do something like that? Uh, by injection. I honestly feel like I'm just playing Plague Inc. in Hoi 4, like, like, why? I mean, I could just play Plague Inc., but, um, nope, I'm, I'm sat here at my computer playing Hoi 4, but, but, as coronavirus. <laughs> the world may be literally imploding around them, but, uh, some things just gotta happen. Uh, the Spanish Civil War is one of those things. <laughs> Oh my god, what, 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 <laughs> Spain, I think you've got bigger things to worry about. Why in the actual hell is there a, is there an Ethiopian guy snaking his way through Indochina? I need answers, I need answers, I don't remember Ethiopia fighting in the Vietnam War. Did I seriously just invade the Soviet Union from the east? Um, yes I did. I mean, it obviously has something to do with me putting it on easy mode, but, um, <laughs> it's honestly still just funny to see. Who would have thought that Stalingrad would have fallen by an invasion from the east? I must say, after so many games of Germany just, like, spamming out those divisions, uh, it definitely feels good to be beating them at their own game. Look who's outnumbering who now. Yeah, the German army is just getting completely swarmed. We have an army of, like, 5 million now. <laughs> well, it looks like even Germany is not strong enough to beat the ultimate country in Hoi 4, uh, coronavirus. <laughs> hey, there we go, London is infected. Imagine doing Operation Sea Lion when you can just, like, infect the UK across the channel, am I right? And, uh, oh yeah, by the way, France is gone, so we're now at war with Spain. Oh my goodness, this is literally an endless war. Am I literally brute forcing my way through the UK? Um, yes. I can't really change any of these infected templates. I can't build anything because honestly, do you expect a virus to know how to build stuff? So I can't improve the supply here. So I am literally brute forcing my way through the UK and uh, I mean, it's literally working. There we go, about freaking time. The UK is gone. And with that, uh, Europe, Africa and Asia are pretty much completely infected. We're away. <laughs> working on South America and Central America. The game is honestly getting insanely laggy with the, uh, with the kind of mad amount of divisions I have right now. I've come to the realization that this game won't end until I literally do a world conquest because I will literally declare war on every single nation I come into contact with. I mean, it makes sense. We're a freaking virus. I'm not really in the mood for a world conquest today. We'll save up for 10k subscribers. Please subscribe. And just in case you thought this mod wasn't stupid enough, I will be back very soon with another one of these and, uh, oh boy, have I managed to somehow find a mod which is even more stupid than this one.